so he's getting ready to ride his motorcycle up that ramp into the truck oh god say a prayer What's going on, Nef Gang? It's a Nef Fam back with another video. If this is your first time tuning in, make sure you go ahead and smash that subscribe button and don't forget to leave a like, a comment, and smash that bell so you can get a notification every time we got a new banger dropping. <laughs> That's right. And as you guys can see, Dance and I are currently in the car because today is the day. The day has come and we're finally picking up the moving truck. So that's where we had it right now. I know I'm excited. I don't know about Dante. Yeah, I'm excited to get this show on the road. Yeah. Get this move started. It's going to be a crazy day because we have to load all of our things that you've seen in yesterday's video, if you have seen it. If not, then go and watch it. But all of our things that are in the garage and some of the stuff, the boxes that we still have in the house, we got to load that onto the truck today. So I'm so ready for everything to just be loaded out of the house because that means we're one step closer to the move. Anything else you got to say before we pick up the truck? I wish I could just like snap my fingers and it'll be over and we'll be in Washington and everything will be in our new home. I'm excited for the ride though. But unfortunately. <laughs> I like to, you know, drive and see things. I think the first 20 hours are going to be crappy though. I don't think we're going to see anything. The yeah, it should be an hours. interesting ride. It's just, yeah. It's just going to be a lot of work. Yeah, it's going to be crazy. But anyways, you guys, let me stop talking. Let's jump right into the video and head to pick up our truck. As you can see we are here it took us a few seconds to find this place because I kind of didn't expect that this would be a little raggedy trailer but <laughs> we did so we did see our truck down there you saw it you know just a few seconds ago I mean I guess I'm not surprised because this place is so super country but uh but I'm just about to go in there and uh, show his driver's license do whatever paperwork pay for the truck and then I'm gonna follow him to the way station and yeah that's that's pretty much it but the time has come so before we get the truck let me show you guys what this place looks like again because I'm like this is trash. Before we get the truck, let me show you guys what this place looks like again because I'm like. So this is the tiny little place that we are, you know, picking up the truck from. And um, as you can see, our truck is over there with the trailer. It's going to be the one on the left right there, this one. We don't have that small dolly we got the big one so it's that truck and uh we're like in this field with mobile homes and i guess some like used cars this little auto sales trailer right there oh god so country all right so dante just walked back out he's right there and i guess he has to like do this little inspection on a truck his truck is going to go on that trailer and we'll be pulling it but yeah let's check out the truck and make sure that there are no damages before we take it so they can't put it on us because we don't need that stuff look how small dante looks in comparison to the truck and we gotta do a cross-country move with that and with that so i'm saying that oh by the way look at this i wonder if somebody lives in that thing I'm telling y'all, this is so trashy country over here. It's crazy. Anyways, back to the topic. I'm saying this is like, I don't know how many feet. 
like probably about 40 feet he has to pull on it move but let's check out the inside this is huge we will most definitely get all of our stuff in here i'm not worried about that but dante's checking out the the damage just to see if there are any damages anywhere so they're not going to blame it on us and charge us for it so i guess i'm gonna go ahead and let him do what he's you know what he gotta do by the way while i'm vlogging i just discovered this look at these steps they are all jacked up so we gotta make sure that he puts this on there too did you see those steps I'm oh, okay they already had that on there as long as this is going to last uh, I'm looking at the tires. I don't know if this is supposed to be flat like this. I never really paid attention to truck tires, but for those of you that know, is this supposed to be flat? Or is it supposed to be like that? Since it's like that on both sides, it's probably supposed to be that way. It's better to put too much on a paper instead of you're missing some of the things or take it easy and not put it on there and then you get charged for it. But anyways, we're going to get back to it. You guys make sure that you stay tuned because we got to take this big thing to the weigh station and go from there. All right, you guys. So I am back and I'm in the car by myself. I'm actually following Dante right now because he's driving that big old truck. And I'm following to the weigh station because we have to go and get the weight of the truck in the trailer while it's empty. And then tomorrow, once we finish loading the whole truck in the trailer, we have to get the weight again while it's full. So sounds a little bit crazy, but anyways, I'm following him right now and I'm like kind of paranoid and I'm scared because that thing seems to be like 40 feet long, but he's probably gonna do a good job. He's used to driving big trucks in the military but i'm over here freaking out so i hope everything's gonna you know go well but anyways let me stop talking i gotta follow him i gotta focus on the road With that being said let's go ahead and jump right into the rest of the video you guys so we are at the weight station and even this place looks like the walking dead you know if you don't know that tv show you need to check it out but with zombies like everything's dead and raggedy let me show you this so dante is right there and he already weighted the truck but he also has to weigh the trailer so that's what he's doing right now and there's the guy like right there where's he at i don't even know i just saw a guy right there he was basically taking the weight of that but check this out look how just scary this place looks i mean maybe it's just me and i'm tripping but everything looks dead so so far all the way from picking up the truck it looked like the walking dead zombie land all the way to getting the weight of the truck but so i can't wait to get back to the house and just load the stuff we got two more days to get out of this crazy country place over here. Dante is driving the truck over to the weight station again. Which is crazy because I didn't know that that thing in the ground is actually, you know, like a weight station. I thought it's actually visible, but it's nothing but a concrete slab. I guess the guy has to give him the okay and then he picks up the ticket. Oh, that was it. So we're headed home guys. We are back at the house and Dante is moving the truck right now. He had already backed it in, but now we probably have to do one of the hardest things to make sure nothing's going to happen. We have to move his motorcycle into the truck. Say what? You think somebody's going to pull up? I mean, if somebody's trying to get to the house right now and we're in a cul-de-sac, we only got three other houses right here. They're just gonna have to wait. But, I don't know. You found it? So Dante has to ride his motorcycle onto this little ramp all the way into the truck. So this should be really interesting. I hope nothing's going to happen. So he's getting ready to ride his motorcycle up that ramp into the truck. Oh God.
that this is going to go well and that he's not going to like flip over on that tiny ramp oh god say a prayer that you were going to flip on this little tiny ramp <laughs> oh my god <laughs> and you with your flip-flops too <laughs> all right so step two is done and now we're gonna get ready to load up our, all of our stuff you guys i'm so sweaty and so dirty i'm ready to take a shower and go to bed and looks like we're getting a crazy storm right now as you guys can see down to just set our uh truck out oh tiana's right there nana it's raining hurry up <laughs> oh my god hurry hurry run <laughs> come on <laughs> why do you need a scooter <laughs> look at those big raindrops Oh man, good thing is we made a lot of progress. This is all the way full and we have a garage again. So we're almost done. So we got to get this in there and our big pool over there in the back. The rain Tetris at the end though. We're going to have to play Tetris to get all these pieces. Yeah, we've been playing Tetris. So the reason why we didn't load everything all the way up to the top is because Dante's motorcycle is all the way in the front as you guys could see at the beginning of the video which is why we didn't stack up the boxes to make sure that they are not going to fall on Dante's bike or he would be really upset anyways you guys we're getting ready to finish loading the truck so we can chill for the rest of the day I also still have to clean the house with that being said it's, she just went back out there come on hurry up you're crazy Yeah, but it's going to start lightning. Anyways, back to the video. We're going to finish loading. <laughs> 